What's up YouTube, PJ back with another video for you guys and sorry about the noise and things in the background. As you can see, they're doing some construction over there across the way, but we're not gonna let that bother us. We have the Genesis again in another video and I'm gonna be doing something with the front. I'm about to head to drop something off at the UPS store right quick and then I have to go to Home Depot to get the necessary materials so I can go ahead and, you know, spice up the front end for y'all just to let y'all know i will be doing something with the grill one thing i did not do is wash the car as you can see i'm sorry about that i really need to wash it actually i don't like the way these these bugs look but i need to get rid of these holes so i'm gonna get something that i could sand down the plastic on this and fill in the holes that this front license plate was on i don't know why they actually drilled holes if anything they should have just got the little adapter piece that goes inside of the tow hook place and then just you know stuck it over there but let me go ahead and get started with this because kiera's in this hot car let me show y'all how hot it is out here Look at this, 96 degrees outside. Look at this. What does it feel like? 109. Yeah, that's why I didn't start the video earlier, but let me go ahead and go. Well, I guess we'll see. What is this you're dropping off again? Uh, wire for my COVID police department mm. that I never use. Okay. The last of the COVID stuff. Nice. Yeah. Hmm? He is. Oh, girl, put me on that camera. <laughs> Like how YouTubers go around in real life and see like what they do, like how they carry their camera. Now you see, cause someone be having on their heads and stuff. Uh huh. Yeah. You ain't gonna watch me. I am gonna watch. I thought. I thought. I am vlogging a video. <laughs> <laughs> now you gotta, now you gotta Smile. <laughs> <laughs> Smile. I do. I do car stuff. Car oh, I like watching car stuff. Yeah. So. I be. Yeah, I be trying to figure out real time, cause I be. I don't know what kind of car you got. It'd be a little more complex than that. Oh, he do stuff like this. They're like cost. Oh, look at this. Come on, Fiona. I'm a cop. You bet. So what? So I can see myself and how pretty I look at what? I'm going to leave you in that one. Bye, y'all. What y'all names? JDB. Oh, I don't know what she said. JDB. JDB. Yeah. Oh, I Sydney. Sydney, thank you, Sydney. Yeah. Who? Anastasia. Anastasia, thank y'all. They ain't gonna watch. <laughs> you might be surprised. Alright, so I just made it back home from Home Depot. And let's see what I got in the bag. All right, got me some gloss black spray paint and also got me some putty that I could put it as plastic with the plastic holes. This should work with it. The water well putty, it says it's for PVC plastic and whatnot. So I'll see how this uh, turns out. If not, then, you know, I'll just figure out another way to plug these holes. But first things first, I need to get this bumper off. This is what the inside of the bumper looks like. And what I'm gonna be doing is, I'm gonna be taking off the top portion right there. I'm gonna try to take off the bash bar and try to get some spray on that. 
And also, I'm gonna take off the bottom portion. I think I'm gonna go with, well, I know I'm gonna go with gloss black for the whole thing, just because I think gloss black is the next best thing to carbon fiber and whenever it comes to trim and i'm just gonna see how that turns out if not then i'll just buy a whole nother grill but let me go ahead and start this little project oh, all right so this is day two of this vlog and look how i drove my car to work just because i didn't finish up the bumper but here it is getting ready for paint um i'm actually not gonna prime it or anything because the paint has primer in it and I feel like it should be okay with that. But uh, yeah, I fixed these holes pretty much. They're as smooth as they're gonna get. I don't really care because this is a temporary fix for the grill. But now I'm about to go ahead and paint it. And I'm just gonna tape off the whole actually painted bumper and cover the lights and do all that stuff. I'm not gonna cover this just because I do have more coming in, like I said. But let me go ahead and get started with this part. Okay, so I'm actually liking how this bumper came out. Um, it's not A1 material just because, you know, it's an old bumper and all the rock chips and stuff that are in the plastic. But as far as the finish, I do like the gloss finish. I'm glad I went with it. I do want to try to get some more fog light bezels because these, I want these to be functional. And they're also the faded color like the grill was. And also the hood scoops on my car. They, I want them to be functional as well and the same black. But this just about wraps up today's video. If you aren't subscribed to the channel, go ahead and subscribe. Comment down in the section below and let me know if y'all learned something or did you just like the video and just anything you have to say and get off your chest. If you like the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and I'll just catch you in the next video. But always remember to do more, be more, believe more, and achieve more. And I thank y'all for watching. <laughs>